So we are now in the Spectrum app. But if we were to go back to the home screen, you would choose the Spectrum app, hit the OK button on the remote. Let's see if I can get a little more light on this. And with the Spectrum app, you're primarily going to be using the direction keys and this return arrow up next to the home button to the left there. So with the regular short guide, you would just hit the navigation arrow to the left and you will see that you have a number of um, channels listed with what's currently on. That's the short guide list. And you can, select the, you can simply select the channel that you want and hit the OK button and it will tune to that channel for you. If you would like to sort that list in a different way, you will notice up at the upper left on screen it says hit left again for filters. So I'm going to hit the navigation arrow to the left and I can apply filters such as channel number, which is how a regular cable box would classically list these in or numeric order. If I sort by network name, then it will list them alphabetically. And there may be advantages to doing that from time to time. But you'll notice you can also filter by uh, local channels, movies, sports, various genres that you can sort through. But one of the best ways to sort this is by the channels you've used recently or by your favorite channels. But you'll notice that starting out, you don't have any favorite channels established. So we will go ahead and put this back on all channels. And in order to use the favorite channels, you would need to use the full guide. And the way you access the full guide is to hit the upper left hand facing return arrow, scroll over to guide, hit OK. And now when it shows you the full guide, you can select channels that you would establish as favorites. So uh, for instance, if you wanted channel 12, you would scroll down to it, but you would also move to the left off of what's currently playing in the current time slot. You would move to the left on the channel icon and number itself, then hit OK. And you'll notice that when I hit OK, it filled in this little heart. And it's telling me that if I hit OK again, it will unfavorite that channel. Or I need to hit OK in order to add it as a favorite. It will not work if you're in the current time slot. It will just take you to that channel and that current programming live. But if you highlight the actual broadcast name and number, then you can establish your favorite channels. And if you just had a handful of them that you liked, for instance, PBS, now we've established around four favorite channels. And if we go to our short guide list now, and we scroll left again to the filters, we can go to favorites, and now it will give us all of the favorite channels we established. You will notice that there are some duplicates, and that's perfectly fine, because channel 1012 is identical to channel 12. It doesn't matter which one you choose, but both will be added to the favorites list when you choose one of those as your favorite because they are identical.